Hello, I'm Drawing Pin, and welcome back to my Let's Play of Mr. Prepper, where of course, if you remember in the last episode, we have a blackout, so the electricity has been cut off for three days. So I was going to go and talk to Joe and do some of that stuff, but we had to build these uh, generators. And to be honest, I kind of needed to build it. Let's get you out of the way now. There we go. Uh, we've got those generators, and then we've got this thing that auto refuels them. So that's brilliant. And I did just kind of hang around till the end of the episode, if you remember. And we just saw those refuel, and that worked fine. And it says they drink fuel, but we'll see how that goes. But from just the brief time that we had with them yet on the last episode... They did not seem to drink that much fuel. So these generators we don't need anymore. So we can take those apart. Um, and I'm kind of tempted to move this down here into this room here. And we'll put another refuel, uh, put another refinery there as well. So we've kind of got the fuel and then we can just put it in there. And we'll make this kind of a more of a refueling area. And we may put some smelters here as well. Not sure what I'm going to do with this room yet. Uh, but I'm hoping we're going to unlock some new rooms. So I think what I'm going to do today is I think electronics is uh, still our main concern because we need the electronics to get up to the uh, next set of the ropeway which is where Jenny wants us to investigate the uh, plane crash and I'd also like to go on a road trip because we haven't been on a road trip for ages so I think I'm going to try and do the road trip today to be honest it says come back and meet Joe I'm assuming that's at night because Joe is a night person but I think we will uh, go and just check that out now I think I'm just going to do some watering first let's pause this Let's just go. That's fine. Yeah, all the power's off, but we're okay because we've got those generators. And yeah, they're not even breaking a sweat on that. Look at that. Although I, I did switch those on, but obviously uh, I switched off, so uh, it didn't save it. But we did see that they had plenty of power at the end of the last episode, so that's good. Uh, right, let's grab some water. We want like six water. That's all good. Uh, we want to make the... Let's separate that out. There we go. We'll just take the six that we need. That's good. There we go. And let's have some food as well. Although, actually, I should probably have uh, harvested. There we are. Ooh. Kate. Okay. Well, let's go and talk to Kate. Did I give her salt in the end of the last episode? I did, did I give her salt or... Hmm. No, I think she wants more sugar or salt. I'm sure she gave me a can of, like, vegetable... Yeah, that. Vegetable soup, I think it was. So, yeah, let's go and talk to Kate. Why not? Hey, can I borrow some flour? Okay, yeah, we have flour. Let's go and collect it. Ooh, I wonder if she's going to make me a cake or something. Uh, flour. Oh, let's just well, let's just grab it all. We don't want it to leave. Let's grab it all, that's fine. And then we'll go back down and we'll water those. I didn't want to leave, so that's kind of why I ran up here. Uh, let's do that. Yes, you can borrow some flour. There we go. Give you a flour. There we go, cake. Brilliant. Right. Yeah, I'm not sure. Uh, I'm not sure what's up with her and Kate, but uh, or Karen and Kate. I was like, I'm kind of convinced they're the same person, um, but uh, maybe they're not. I don't know. I feel like they are though. All right. Let's go there. We'll put. Uh, let's take that stuff out, and we'll might as well stick it in the dryer. Have we got stuff. Yeah, we've already got stuff. But we can refill our dried meat because we don't have much of that, so that's good. So let's get ready. I'm going to grab a load of fuel out of these barrels. I think we might store the oil, excess oil in those barrels would be kind of nice, but I'm not sure that we're going to need that, but let's go with it anyway. That's good. And let's put you onto our hot bar there. There we go. That's good. Got loads of dried meat. Perfect. We'll come down here. We'll water these things. Oh, they might need... Oh, they need harvesting, actually. That's fine. Let's water them anyway. I think just water them daily and then it's all done. Uh, we also going to need uh, oranges back up and running again, actually. That's a good point. Do I have any oranges? Because those energy bars seem like they're going to be really good. Uh, so we probably want those. No. I don't think I have any oranges. Uh, that's cabbages, isn't it? That's tomatoes. We want the tomatoes as well. But uh, I'm going to try and stay focused uh, <laughs> if I can. That's going to be difficult, but I'm going to try and do it. Oh, boy. We don't have enough room. Let's get rid of those. Should we just eat those? Oh, that's a good idea. We're just going to do it. Why not? <laughs> that's fine. Yeah, we need the freezer as well. Uh, so let's grab... I think we're going to grab some fuel. I don't know whether Joe is sort of uh, ready for... I say, I feel like he's, uh, he's a night person, so 
I don't think he's going to be up, but let's just, uh, can we just take as much of that as we can? There we go. Let's go and dump it in here first. I'm not sure how much fuel the car takes. What other stuff have we got? Yeah, right, we need to empty some other things off as well. Let's put, let's just refill that sucker completely up. There we go. That's almost full now. That's, that's brilliant. Right, let's dump some of the baits and stuff off because we don't need those. Let's put those in there. Let's put that in there. Uh, we want the pistol, so let's take that with us. Can we stack those on top of each other? Ooh, nice. We can. Uh, I'm going to take the pickaxe because you never know, we might need a pickaxe. And we're pretty empty on everything else. I think that's good. We've got those energy bars, so we're good for energy. Let's come up here. Let's grab that. We'll go and talk to Joe, but I don't think he's going to uh, be at home. I don't know how much fuel we need. Let's just take as much fuel as we can carry. I think it's five for each sort of section of the journey. So if we take take another full stack. There we go. That's good. Uh, let's just check the trades as well before we go. Because uh, electronics. Yeah, we've only got like two electronics. And we need ten to get up to the roadway. Plus we want to build those uh, like the irrigation systems and stuff. So we're going to really need that electronics more than anything. Those are kind of rubbish, aren't they, for the price? Ugh, I don't really want to do that. And we don't get electronics, and it's plastic. That is a shame. I'm going to hold off on those phones. Um, we're not desperate, so I think we're going to hold off. Uh, we'll get the extra fuel off Joe as well. It's slowly leveling him up, so uh, I think that's a good call. Uh, we need to buy books as well, but, you know, we're not going to do that. Got no money, but I'm okay with that. Right, let's go and see if Joe's home, but I don't think he's going to be. Uh, he's more of a night person, so we'll probably have to come back at night and do that. Uh, you can disassemble grenades. Yes, you can. Yeah, he's not here. Can't take his Dr. Prepper either. Ooh, no, he's put the radio on. Okay. Let's fuel this thing up. Ooh, drive. Should we just drive forward? Or do we need to come back to Joe later? I think we've got to wait. I, I could drive forward, but I think I'm going to wait. Um, yeah, I think I'm going to hold off on that. Yeah, I think we're going to wait because uh, it says come back to meet Joe. So I was just getting a little bit of a screenshot then. Um, yeah, it says come back and meet, talk to Joe later. So I'm going to assume we're going to need to uh, come back later. I kind of figured that, but... Uh, yeah, he's got like a night sign as well. Meet me in the night, yeah. I, I kind of figured that was the case, but, you know, I thought we'd just go back and quickly check anyway. There's no harm in uh, checking on that one. So that's good. So we do need to take apart stuff. So what do we have? We had two electronics. And how much did all this? So the freezer... Freezer's just metal. We could make that, actually, couldn't we? Um, what did the irrigation stuff cost that was like electronics wasn't it four electronics and eight electronics yeah so we could make the uh, I really want to make the disco switch as well but that's going to be uh, that's going to be expensive uh, where are we the free hang on I've gone past it well yeah we could make the freezer so we just need the metal which we could take apart those oh we're getting a little uh, little unprepared let's Eat that. There we go. Damn, yeah, those bars are really good. Wow, did that... Oh, did that give us all the fuel back? Because we didn't go on the trip? Hmm. Okay, well, at least we need, know we don't need all that fuel, so that's good. Let's come down here and we'll store that there. I think we've got some of these. We can take those apart and get the metal back. Let's try and make the freezer. Although, we don't really have anywhere to put it, do we? I'm going to make some lights. Uh, let's make lights. That is really what we need. Let's grab those. We don't need those, so that's good. Got these generators. They're working perfectly. They're fantastic. There we go. Grab. There we are. Back up and running again. Sweet. That's just refueled. That's good. All right. Uh, do we have... I think we have one of these generators. We had one knocking about, didn't we, somewhere as well? Sure we did. Yeah, there we go. Let's take those apart because uh, they're going to get us uh, going to get us all the metal we're going to need now. That's going to be twelve a piece. So yeah, let's take those apart. 
It's going to really sort us out with the metal. There we go. And then we should be able to make that freezer. I'm not sure if we're going to put that down yet. I don't know where to put it. So, uh, you know, but we've got the metal for it anyway. I'd like to just build it and then we've got it. And we'll go back to Joe in a bit. Oof, that's going to take a long time. Let's build that. Plastic is going to be really tight again. Plastic and electronics are the two that we're mainly concerned. But I'm assuming we're probably going to be able to mine... I'll, I'll air quotes that mine plastic. I know you don't mine plastic, but you know what I mean. I'm assuming we might be able to find somewhere in a desert that has just a ton of plastic or something. Uh, we might get that. So cool. How big is this freezer? Yeah, it's pretty big. Fair enough. So that's what I figured, but you know. Um, I mean, we could put it in there, but I kind of want to start organizing this place. So I think we'll just, we've built it. We've got it in the reserve. That's great. I think I don't think we really need to do much more than that. Uh, I might take some grenades with me as well. Although, gun seems pretty awesome, to be honest. But yeah, let's uh, let's come back anyway. I'll leave the mail in, and let's go and talk to Joe, and then we can hopefully unlock the rest of the quest. That would be nice. Let's go back and talk to him now. And then, yeah, I want to I go off and do some uh, missions and stuff, and unlock some new room types or something. I'm not too sure, but, you know. Woof, there we go. Let's talk. Let's see what he's done. Hey. hey buddy, I've fixed the car up with a radio. I bet it's strong enough to pick up something. Mm. Now you can venture into the desert and pick up the broadcast. I'm dying to know its content. Mm. I'll write it down for you when I catch it. Okay, so catch the signal. Well, I'm not going to go there now because, uh, you know, it's too late in the day for that. Ask. Ah. Hey, who's a good boy? Stare suspiciously. Okay. Chupacabra doesn't do this bullshit. <laughs> but don't you worry. He's a fine, friendly dog. He looks fit and smart. So uh, does he help with your business? Yep, he scares off vermins and odd wanderers who stray into the area. Helps me find some stuff when I'm too forgetful. Oh, I could do with that. It's been ten years or so since I found him. By the way, I haven't seen any of the dogs around for quite a while, quite some time already. Weird, isn't it? Hmm, me neither. So it's even more lucky that you two uh, have each other. Woof. There we go. Uh, I don't think there's anything else we can grab here. I can't see anything. Yeah, right. We'll come back tomorrow now because uh, there's not much point. You know, uh, we've got to we've got to get back to bed by three o'clock in the morning. So. Uh, we're going to do that. So we're ready to do that. We're going to go for a road trip next. That's going to be great. Let's grab all the mail that we got out here. Which is largely fuel and a radio. That's fine. So we'll uh, come down here. We'll take apart the radio. Uh, we'll put the fuel away. And then we'll go to go and get a nice early night, I think. It's going to get us a little bit of plastic and electronics. That's largely what we want. Metal is less important. Feels like I didn't get... Don't I get 24 metal? Oh no, I built it. Yeah, no. I was just going to say, hang on, where did all my metal go? I took loads of uh, generators apart, but of course I <laughs> I just uh, I just made a freezer. So yeah, that's where all that metal went. Never mind. It's just me. Don't worry about it. Um, right, let's uh, let's go to bed. I think everything... Okay, should we go and harvest those just in case? Let's go and harvest that. There we are. That's fine. Uh, we might as well dry up those berries. So I'm not sure that we actually need that Dr. Prepper anymore. With these energy bars, I'm not sure if we really need it. We're going to have it, but I'm not sure as we need it desperately. There we go. I really need to have a day where I just cook things. Um, I think I might do that after this or something. Just cook up a load of that Dr. Prepper or something. But so uh, yeah, let's go. Uh, we've got some old newspapers. I wonder if Nancy wants those. Just kind of get rid of them out of our hair then. That would be good. No, she doesn't seem to want old newspapers anymore. Fair enough. Right, let's go to bed. Let's get a good night's sleep. And then we're going to go, we'll water. We'll water the crops. We will um, grab some food. And then we'll uh, we'll go and uh, hit it. And we'll go into the desert. And we'll see what we find in there. Because that's going to be good. Going to be good. Hopefully. Right. Come on. 
inspecting items and reading their descriptions give you useful tips yes it does as I say we do also need to take apart uh, the furniture in this place the cooker and all this sort of stuff I was like I want to know if I can take apart these cupboards and use them um, I think I'm um, hopefully I can I could take them apart you just didn't learn the recipe in the beta so I'm hoping that's uh, different this time around let's grab that and separate you out into one so we only need six there we go come over here because we're probably close to having to okay yeah everything's out of water kind of what I figured there we go excellent and we'll come down here we need to set off uh, this as well but right now we don't have any money so uh, we're gonna need to make some money again which is probably go to the forest and just uh, you know get a load of that but we're getting the apples but we don't have any oranges so yeah not great right that's everything refueled we've got the fuel on us we've got a bit of food got plenty of fuel on us it's separated it all out now it was in one big stack a minute ago and then do we have any weapons on us okay I've already got a pickaxe on me so let's dump that off just just in case we might need a pickaxe to break something or we might need a axe to chop something down so I think I'm kind of taking both of those let's put the gun in this hand I think let's reload that because that's going to be really useful oh hello um should we just greet Kate with a gun yeah, let's just greet Kate with a gun why not hello Kate Hello, neighbour. She's not too worried about that. I have this for you. Oh, a meat pie. Nice. Um, no offence, Kate, but I'm probably just going to go and... Oh, damn it. I kind of I kind of wanted to sell that, but never mind. Let's put it away. Uh, we've got some food that's gone off. That's okay, though. I'm okay with that. Let's let's go. Let's stay focused. Right? Do we have everything we need? We got so we got some doctor prep. We got some food. We got some energy bars. We have got plenty of food there. We're all good. Got the fuel. To, I don't know how far we're going to go out. So I'm just kind of refueling it. You know, it might be only going once. It won't be only ten units of fuel, or it might be twenty units of fuel. I have no idea. So let's go. And uh, what did actually the objective tell us to do? I didn't read it. Uh, catch the signal. So I guess we just got to drive through the desert or something. I don't know. Let's find out. Refuel this sucker. That's kind of a cool. Uh, quite like that with the uh, with the antenna. I was just going to try and get a screenshot. There we go. Should have got one now. There we are. Perfect. Right. Let's fuel this sucker up. Put those back on. Refuel, refuel, and then refuel. And then let's drive forward. Let's go. Road trip number two. And we are... Oh boy, hopefully I don't crash the car either. There we go. Let's keep on going. I don't know where we're going to drive to or what, so... You know, I've only ever driven to the uh, petrol station out in the desert, gas station out in the desert, so... Uh, you know, where do we go? I don't know. I'm assuming this thing's going to stop bleeping or something at some point. Um, I really don't know. But there you go. So we're dodging this stuff. That's all good. Let's keep on going. Uh, I haven't come across a jump yet. Okay, right. So... Hmm... Ooh. Oh, hello. Okay, where the hell are we? I have no idea. Uh, where are we? I don't know. I've got the cactus, though. Yeah, this gun's just... Hmm. Oh, hmm, I have no memory of this place. Perhaps I took a different turn than the last time. Ah. So, maybe I'm not in the right place? Oh well, there's stuff here. Let's grab it. Can of food. Oh, no, 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 no. Grab. Don't eat it. Grab it. There we go. We're okay. 
Let's open and inspect this thing. A little bit of metal. Can we grab the box? Yes, we can. Okay, so... Ooh, there's a plate behind it. We'll have that. Is there anything else? I'm sure there was something else there as well. Grab whatever that is. Oh, some money. Okay. Some prepper coins. Okay. Right. Uh, hmm. Okay, so... Yeah, I'm lost. <laughs> Did I drive too far? Drive forwards again? I just keep driving forward, I guess. I don't know. Just keep going. Oh, hello. A boost. Hold right mouse button or left shift to boost the car to accelerate when the car goes up or up the ramp and jumps safely. Okay. There we are. Yeah, I was just uh, wondering... Oh my god! I just crashed. Into a cacti. Yeah, I was just wondering about the uh, ramps. I haven't actually seen any of those. We had some in the beta, but uh, I've not experienced any yet. So I assume we just keep going along till the next uh, post. I, I really don't know how the car works. So, uh, you know, we'll figure it out there. Jump! This car's taken a little bit of damage. But uh, for the most part, it's not too bad. Okay, we're on to the next location. Right. Ooh. Desert. taking down these snakes man this pistol is so good can you not get to us yeah pistol is nice ooh scrap okay what else is here oh like another junkyard oh it's joe's it's just a different type of joe's okay let's grab all this stuff grab the fuel that's going to be handy grab the Grab that. We will grab that as well. There's an axe there as well, I think. Grab that. Oh, can we not grab it? Okay, fair enough. Let's grab the box. And then, ooh, there's some money on the top there. Grab some money. Grab the cup as well. Not sure whether we need to grab all that stuff. Ooh, hello, scrap. And a bit more scrap there. I think Joe buys that stuff, so, you know, that's a good thing. Okay, yeah, so we just found another junkyard then. Okay, interesting. Right, let's get moving, because uh, it's like starting to get late in the day, and I'm kind of worried we're uh, going to be out here really late. So, let's, uh, let's have one of those. Let's try. Ooh, do we have... Uh, Got, yeah, I've got some metal on me. Three metal. Yeah, let's repair that. Although I'm just wasting an hour, actually, so I've just thought about that. We probably don't want to do that. So that's just cut down the time, but never mind. Let's drive. Let's keep driving forwards, I guess. Do we need fuel to get back? I don't think we do. I think the journey back's free, so I'm going to hope it is, because, uh, yeah, we're not going to have enough to get home otherwise. Let's just keep on going. Hit the boost. There we are. Oh. Oh, cacti. Oh, did I? I think I went the wrong way on that one. Yeah, that one was already in the road, wasn't it? That one was slightly different, I think, that one. Maybe it wasn't, though. I don't know. Oh. Crap. Okay. <laughs> oh, wow. That really damaged the car. Oh, my God. Dang, that really damaged the car. Oh, God. There we go. Oof. Well, we ain't going to go much further, I don't think. I wonder what happens if you smash the car out here and it's stranded in the desert. Game over, maybe? I mean, maybe I should be, like, interacting with the antenna or something. Use. Oh, no, no, no. Don't, don't use it yet, dummy. Yeah, do you know what? I've kind of just missed a trick right there. 
Oh. <laughs> oh man, that thing is so good. Yeah, I think I'm supposed to have been using that. No, can I not? There we go, let's use it. Maybe now I'll have more luck. Government medical memory... Not. Damn, it's impossible to make anything sense out of this. I need to try something else. I'm going to assume i got to go further. Grab. Ooh, a cabin. We could go in it as well. Ooh. Let's grab. I'm going to go in the cabin first, I think. Oh, just... Okay, there we don't know. Ooh. Right. Can I just chuck these away? Oh, that's a shame. Can I chuck the cups on the floor? I can't. That's that's a that's a pity. Uh, can I take the... Yeah, I picked up way too much stuff. Anything good in there? I'll take what we can. Oh, nice. I could grab all those. Uh, let's put those away. Let's try and throw some stuff away that we don't want. I'm going to chuck some of these boxes away because I don't necessarily need those. The fuel is more enticing to me, I think. And uh, the axe would be good because we can sell those to Joe. Cups, I'm not too bothered about. I'm going to be a bit more picky. Take the food, though. Let's take the food. Right, I want to kind of get a wriggle on and... <sighs> Man, oh wow, that is a that is a nice, neat line, isn't it? Do we repair this thing? How much to repair? Six. Do we even have six? Okay, we have one. <sighs> Let's drive on. Let's keep driving forwards. I'm going to assume we're going to drive the whole way. But, yeah. Right, got to keep my wits about me now. Oh, and he just crashed it. Yeah, there we go. Well done, Pin. Keep my wits about me and back. Oh my god, these things are coming like thick and fast. Oh my god. Oh no, don't do that. Oh crap. Okay, what happens? Oh. Okay, we just get towed back to Joe's. Fair enough. I'll take that. Right. Uh, what do we need to repair this thing? Because we're going to have to bring some metal back. 12 metal. Okay, right. I need that stuff on me. I need to carry that with me. Trade? Because I think you buy the plastic, don't you? Oh, sell the axes and stuff to you. Why not? Uh, and we could buy an axe? Okay. Never mind, Joe. Oh, we just leveled him up. What else does he have? Oh, nothing? Or does he just buy buy more stuff off us? Hmm. Yeah, nothing. Okay, right. Well, we'll try that again. Yeah, I, I, I don't know whether I did that right. Maybe I should have done that at the first one. I'm assuming I've got to get all the way to the end of that track, which is going to be rough. That is going to be tough. Okay. Let's come down here. I kind of wish I'd brought some more, more of that stuff with me but never mind uh, I'm going to hang on to that because Joe does buy it so I feel like hanging on to it is probably a good idea uh, I've got some meat and some cacti and some other things so maybe we'll come and uh, check that in there uh, let's eat those I'm going to take those with us because yeah, we've got so much food now oh boy I'm going to take those and make some more energy bars. How's the farm looking? Should be good till the morning, I think. I think it's going to be okay till the morning. This stuff's probably ready to be picked. Yes, it is. Will it wait till the morning? I don't know as it will. Hopefully it will. Okay. Separate. Go there. Yes, yeah, so that just cost me a hell of a lot of fuel. Okay. <laughs> energy bar I thought I had the stuff on me did I not pick the stuff up oh did I not 
Oh, I didn't pick it up, did I? Separated it and didn't pick it up. Yay, pin. Well done. Okay. Let's make some energy bars. There we go. That's all good. That's going to empty some space up as well, so that's perfect. Put those back. Uh, I've got loads of cans of food as well. So we're all good there. Oh, wow. I wonder if uh, Jenny wants any of that stuff. We'll put those away. Uh, yeah, does she? Does Jenny want any mouldy food? And then we've got all that scrap. I think I'm going to hang on to that because um, who the huntress might want? Yeah. No, you don't. Fair enough. Uh, Joe often wants to buy that. What is that? Some fabrics as well. Okay. Let's dump this. Dump that fabric off. There. Still got a few things in there. And then let's go and uh, grab up some more fuel. Have we got any more fuel left to refine? That's a good point. I think I might still have some fuel down there, to be honest. Uh, some oil. Yeah, we've got a bit more oil. Okay, we can't put any more in. We'll just do that one. And then we'll come back and grab it again and do it. There we go. There we go. So we're going to need to... Uh, that's going to tap us out of fuel completely. Oh, boy. Okay. Right. Let's chuck off the scraps for now. Like, we can either take them apart for plastic. Or we can, uh, you know, we can sell them to Joe. I kind of want to sell them to Joe, to be perfectly honest. Wow, those are... Damn, those are heavy. Joe, I'm just going to... I'm going to put them at the top. I'll try, and I'll try and remember we've got them. So, you know. I'm not going to remember. <laughs> uh, I think that's probably okay. And I also need to grab metal. Uh, ooh! Can we just... Are we just linked to that thing and we can just take stuff out whenever we want? Yeah, I think we might be linked to that. Yeah, I've got a load of metal, so that's good. Right, let's go to bed. Ooh, Postman's just coming in as well. Let's go to sleep, and then we'll try that again, but I'm probably going to fail on it massively, so... Yeah, <laughs> that was that was rough. But uh, if we take some metal with us, then that's going to be a good thing. Uh, we can repair the car a few times. I'm assuming if it gets trashed, that's it. Uh, you go back to the start, so... Oh boy, that's rough. Okay, right. Let's reload that. How many bullets do we have? Because we did burn through a lot, didn't we? Oh yeah, we got plenty. And we can always fight them, and we got some grenades as well, so I think we're good there. Uh, let's come and we'll come down here. We'll water this stuff, and then uh, we'll get to it. Did that just... Did I just put that in the... I could have sworn that looked like it put it there, but there we go. Was that just me? There we go. Let's grab that. Let's come up here. We'll water those. I don't really need these things, I don't think. I've got just too many of them. But, well, we'll do it. Probably need some more dryers. Let's get those all watered up. Nice. Let's come down here. Uh, those are all probably ready to be picked as well. Yeah, we've got to get the oranges on the go. Uh, I wonder if Joe wants any scrap. I really hope he does. Pick those, water those. Water, water, there we are. Yeah, it's like these berries as well. I, I'm going to have to uh, take a day, I think, and just like cook. Or a couple of days or something and just cook this, up these berries. So, yeah, that's something we got to do. I'm going to dry the apples gonna dry the apples got just enough of that stuff there yeah oranges Ooh, we need to drive those as well because they're gonna go off soon oh boy so much to do okay uh, do we have any fuel going in there not a lot do we take take a couple extra I think that's gonna be enough uh, let's just check let's check Joe let's see if Nancy wants a paper. She hasn't wanted a newspaper for a while, though, so I don't know whether she will want that. 
Do you want? No, you don't seem to want newspapers anymore. Do you want mouldy food? Yes, you do. Great. And then does Joe? Yes, he wants scrap. How many does he want? Five. Ooh. It's gonna be a pretty good payday, actually. Nice. Yeah, that's why. I mean, I could take that apart and get the plastic and the metal, but I think selling that to Joe is uh, going to be better. I think. One, two, three, four, four. Oh, crap! Can't carry any more. Um, does that thing weigh? It doesn't really weigh anything, does it? Okay, all right. Uh, the moldy food doesn't weigh anything. The cans weigh a lot, though, don't they? There we go. I think we've got enough food anyway, so yeah, we're all right. We've got energy drinks, we've got energy bars, we've got cans of food. There seems to be like a lot of food when you're out there anyway, so. Actually, do you know what? We'll buy those off you. I think just buying the fuel off him is a good call all the way. Right. Let's go back and let's, tr let's try this again. Probably going to fail, but uh, let's try this again. <laughs> Um, I got metal on me though, so I've got as much metal as I can carry, which is 25, so we can repair the car. But, I mean, that's going to take 12 metal. Damn. Oh boy, that's really going to tap me out of metal, isn't it? Maybe I should have... Uh, uh, well, do we need to put all the fuel? Well, let's just put all the fuel in. I'm not sure how this works, so. Just refuel that sucker. There we go. Let's drive forwards. And then where do we carry on? Do we just go through each phase again, I guess? I'm not too sure. I'm guessing we're going to have to take five drives to get there. Oh! Come on, pin. Keep your head together. Going to try and concentrate a little bit more and not talk so much so if I'm a little quiet in these sections that's what I'm doing yeah there we go just try and just try not to wreck the car there we go but uh, yeah that's going to get rough I think Ooh. there we are we made it can we make it all the way ok the first section is over that is good. I like it. I assume we probably want to check the... Okay, this stuff here. Anything else here? Just kill all this stuff off. Ooh! There's like a mine. Sweet. Uh, I think I'm just going to check the antenna. Hmm. Now let's see if the radio picks anything up. Static. Nothing whatsoever. I need to go further out. Yeah, okay. That's kind of what I figured. Um, I can't resist looting. It's a disease. Let's take down that snake. I think I'm just going to grab... Ooh. I sure is driving uh, the same route as last time. And yet it looks different. Is it because of the fabled mirages or what? Yeah, we are driving somewhere totally. I wonder if it's just random locations you go to. I think I'm just going to take like the fuel and just the more important stuff. Take the scrap. I'm going to leave the boxes. Ooh, that's a... Uh, I don't really care. I'm going to leave that. It's too heavy. I don't really care about it. I think I'm just going to leave it. Grab the cacti. We'll grab the fuel and like, you know, any metal or anything like that. I think we'll definitely take that stuff with us. Let's... Drink our last one of those, that's good. And we'll have a bite to eat as well. Let's drive further. Let's drive forwards. And then, yeah, I say I've really got to concentrate. I'm assuming I'm going to do five of these, which is going to be a blooming nightmare. I don't know if I'm going to actually make it. Hopefully, I do. But, yeah, it's going to be difficult. God, yeah, it's throwing lefts and rights on me now. It's tough to. Uh, it's like you just want to press the button. Uh, every time you see something, but it's like you kind of got to try and judge it as to whether it's actually real warrants a dodge or not. And uh, at the moment, let's just keep going. I think we're going to start meeting the ramps in the next phase. So I'm assuming everywhere it looks like it's just different, so that's cool. Ooh, 
dodge just about. Oof, there we go. So I'm assuming it's going to be a new location. I think I am just going to quickly... We'll check the antenna. We'll check everything. I'll say I'm assuming i got to get out here as far as we can. Uh, we're going to have to blow some more bullets off Joe as well. Because... Uh... Okay. Kind of trick shot there. Uh, the scrap would be nice just to... Shall we? Let's just quickly come and deal with all these things. Get rid of them. Let's just do that. Just uh, reduce the wolf population down slightly. How complicated this is this? I swear I've uh, seen this same place twice here. Yeah. Yeah, so there's something weird going on with the desert. Ooh. I'm going to leave the food. Grab the fuel. i say I think I'm just going to take the essentials. We'll take that stuff. Uh, do I want to grab the... I'm going to grab the food. I can't not grab stuff. It's just a disease. I just, I'm just i like a hoover in these games. I just uh, can't not pick stuff up. Yeah, it's taken me a long... I feel like uh, I'm taking even slower than I did last time. Let's go. Maybe now I'll have more luck. Government, medical, memory, not. Static. Okay. Damn, it's impossible to make anything sensible out of it. I need to try somewhere else. Okay, let's drive on further. <sighs> okay, right, here we go. Let's get a little bit further out. Let's uh, try and concentrate. It's got a boost come in. Let's boost. There we are. We've got past that. Oh my god, another boost. There we are. No, don't turn into that one. Ugh. I was say, you see something and you just turn into it. It's just... Ah, oh God, yeah. It's so difficult. Okay, oh my God, more boosts. Okay, boost again. There we go. No, don't turn, don't turn. <sighs> Another boost. Let's go again. Oh, let's, oh, wow, another boost. There we go. God, how many jumps? Like Evil Knievel drive here or what? Dang. <laughs> right. I really just want to check the uh, check everything out, but I think uh, the coyotes are not going to allow me to do that. Hmm. Maybe now I'll have more luck. Government medical memory static. Okay, no. Oh, I'm just going to make my way out now. I'm going to ignore everything that's here. Ooh. Can I pick the Dr. Prepper up? I'm just going to leave it. I'm going to leave it. I've got to stay focused. I want to grab that stuff so bad, but I'm going to just drive on, I think. Let's keep going. And hopefully we can actually survive. Okay, right. Get concentrating. Let's dodge that one. Get ready to boost. Don't dodge that. Get ready to boost again. Don't dodge that one. Get ready to boost again. Ooh. Dodge that though. Oh, come on, man. That did not seem to react to me. Or was that just me? Okay, right. we got one more life. Oh, oh my god. No, 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 no. Okay. Okay, keep going, keep going. Yes, we made it. Oh, God. Please let that be the last place to go. <laughs> please let that be the last place. Oh, my God. Damn, what the hell's that thing? Like a freaking anaconda or something. Uh. God damn. Wow. Yeah, like the... Ooh. Hello, a plane crash. I really want to check you out, but... Ooh. Oh, God, no. Okay, let's check, let's check the radio first. I want to check those boxes. Oh, I'm really being stupid now, I know, but... Okay, let's try it again. Brazen Serpent, Tool, Series of Terrorists, Ready for the Borders, Static. Yeah, I've got to go. The signal is stronger, but the message does not get more understandable. Oh, God. Okay. 
Well, we've got to repair this thing. Let's just do... We've got to do that. We have to repair it. Uh, we're never going to make it. We're just going to get there in the dark. I really want to see what's in those boxes. Okay. It's going to be dark when we do this, unfortunately. But that's just the way it's going to be. We've got the headlights, so that's good. I want to see what's in these boxes. I don't know what's in those boxes. I don't think there's going to be anything. Ooh. Bullets. I'll take that. <gasps> rifle. <sighs> rifle. We got a rifle. Oh, sweet. Kind of tempted to use the rifle. Let's get back here. Let's get rid of that. Let's put the rifle in. Yeah, let's go with the rifle. Right, let's drive. We're going to be doing this at night. Not ideal, but let's try it. Swing and a miss, hopefully. Oh my god. Okay, right, this is not going to be good. Right, dodge. Dodge. Don't dodge. Boost. Can't want the boost because they're a bit easier. Dodge. Don't dodge. Boost. Dodge. Dodge again. Don't dodge, I don't think. Boost. Don't dodge. Oh, we made it. Oh my god, I made it. Ugh. Please let this be it now. There's going to be a crap ton of stuff here first though, isn't there? Damn, we're just like nailing everything. Do you want know the rifle's pretty sweet? <laughs> that carries like loads of ammo. I like that. Okay, let's gotta use this now. This has gotta be it. Hmm. I have a good feeling about this, let's try. Attention all citizens of the United States of America, your government is lying to you. The Brazen Serpent Satellite is not a medical project. Brazen Serpent is a mind control tool. Ooh, so that would explain everyone's, like, headaches and all that sort of stuff. They, you know, beam thoughts or whatever. Brazen Serpent causes lack of motivation, memory problems, and vulnerability to manipulation. A series of terrorist attacks is thought to be linked with Brazen Serpent. Citizens of the United States revolt against your government or defeat or defect to our side. Uh, we have help for you ready at the borders. Uh, you do not have to suffer. Attention all citizens broadcast repeats itself. Wow. Cool. So yeah, they are... It all makes sense, but damn, this sounds serious. And it seems at least one of Joe's conspiracy theories was right. I wonder how he'll take it. Okay, cool. Right, let's loot the area first. Damn, this rifle is sweet. Ooh. It's a UFO! <laughs> oh, I wish it was daytime. I could get a screenshot of that. Ah, oh, damn it. US Army? Oh my god, okay. Well, we're going to take... I'm going to take the Army box. Ooh, that's good. I'm going to take the Army box because I want that. And then we could probably make those, hopefully. Let's give me some electronics. Grab... Oh, man, the there's a UFO. Oh, I really, really, really wish it wasn't dark. I could take a screenshot of that. Oh, that's such a shame. Such a shame it's dark. Although, nah, spoiler. Let's not do that. We are desert driving, right. I think I grabbed everything. Let's get back and we'll talk to Joe before uh, it's, getting, it's getting late. So let's drive back. It's back to Joe. So everything seems to be random every time you come in. The, the, uh, the ramps and the dodges and all that stuff. The places that you go. Uh, the, all the locations seem randomised. So that's kind of cool. I like that. Woof, there we go. Let's talk to Joe. Hey. hey, Prepo, have you caught the transmission? I have, yes. It's read with a strong Spanish accent. I've written it down, but I can tell you the main points. Mm. Do it now, I'm anxious to know. They're basically saying Brazen Surface Satellite is a mind control tool. And this is intent, and this indeed would explain a lot of things. <laughs> The waves, I told you, Prepper. 
They also said it causes memory and concentration problems. Oh, and they blame it for some terrorist attacks. Ah. This, I don't know, Prepper. I feel broken. I was afraid of, my, of the mind control ways for some time, but I secretly hoped it wasn't true. Hmm. Now I know for sure that this thing is circling above us constantly. And did the Mex Mexicans have any advice for us? They're telling us to revolt or escape to, the, to their side. A walk in the park, right? Hmm. Damn prepper, I'm too old and weak to leave this junkyard and take Chupacabre with me. Oh. But I know you can outsmart them. Escape from here, maybe fight fight from the outside. Hmm. Please do it for us. Hmm. Thanks, Joe. Trust me, I'm going to do, do what I can. Hey. hey, Joe, I have an important question I, and I suspect you know the answer. Could you tell me how to get to Fort Observer military base? I know it's uh, in the desert somewhere. Hmm? Oh, chasing the military secret now, Prepper, aren't you? Oh. I can tell you for sure they ain't got UFOs like in Area 51. I have good intel on that. Oh. No, we just found an intel. We have found one in the desert. Some say it's haunted, though. Uh, you need to be careful. Uh. I'll try. There might just be something I need out there. Okay, buddy, I can show you it on the map. Hmm. So there it is, a long stretch of road from the last pass, last place you uh, got the supply stash. Oh. Okay. Which leads to another problem. Hmm. It's too long to make it in uh, one go before 3 a.m. knocks me out. Hmm. You're smart prepper, and yes, I'd say it ain't possible unless you find a way to stay awake. Okay. Um. I might have an idea on how to deal with this. Thank you, Joe. Ooh, so can we just stay up all night? So ask Joe about Fort Observer. Go to Fort Observer. But we need some something else. I'm going to say Jenny with the with the herbal teas and stuff might be the solution there. Or well, that's either Cubby and Bob, I guess, down in the uh, basement. Uh, da basement. Down in the mine. But damn, this has been a long episode. Wow, okay. Right, I think we're just going to go straight to bed. And, uh, yeah, everything else looks good. Yeah, that's all cool. Right. Damn, this was a long episode. I didn't think it was going to be this long, but, yeah, it took a long time. I guess you don't lose time when you're traveling in the car. I guess the time's paused. I'm not too sure on that one, but I guess it is. Because uh, I'm just looking at the clock, and it's like 50-odd minutes. So, yeah, this is going to be a long episode. But I uh, hope you guys have been cool with that. And, uh, yeah, we got a rifle. We found a UFO in the desert. Um, yeah, brilliant. I managed to do it as well. I did not think I was going to do that in the dark, but I uh, just managed to dodge that. The rifle is awesome. It's like it holds, what, like 7, 14 shots or something. So, yeah, I'm kind of digging the rifle right now. I'm not sure they're going to take the revolver with me. Uh, the rifle seems awesome. Um, but, uh, yeah, as I say, I think this is where I'm going to call it anyway. I'm going to end the episode because it's uh, running a bit long. But uh, I'm sure you guys are kind of cool with that. Um, so, yeah, I think this is where I'm going to call it in any episode. So if you like that one, please give me a thumbs up. Comment your thoughts down below. Subscribe for more. I really do appreciate it. Stay safe out there, everyone. And I'll catch you next time.